Hello Leo and welcome to your Twin Flame reading for May 2022. So if you're cross watching for your twin or this is your sign, this reading is going to resonate with you. So we're going to check in with one deck of cards today, the beautiful star tarot and see what's coming in. So thank you angels. What's the energy please around May? What's coming in around May for Twin Flames or Leo? Here we go. So the first card we've got is the Wheel of Fortune. Now, this is beautiful because you've been reminded with the number 10. So you may start seeing 1010 10, that it's all about divine power, that the divine has got you, that the universe truly does have your back and that things are falling into place, that magic is taking place in your connection. But you must believe so things are happening in divine timing. And the Wheel of Fortune is also about cycles. So I feel this is you about to enter a new cycle. And they show me this here. We've got the white stag on this kind of energy at the top there. So this is about mission and purpose. And I'm actually being shown this intuitively as a polar bear. And polar bears are all about perseverance. So the message here from your twin and from your angels is don't give up on your journey because your dreams are manifesting sooner than you think. And you've got this gorgeous eagle showing that to you, to fly high, to rise above drama and to see through illusion, to focus on the love. And the wolf there is reminding you that you are always connected, that you are telepathic beings, that you are one and that you are connected by the power of love, but also the power of your strength. And that comes from within. It comes from above you, from heaven, and it comes from the connection you guys share. So whenever you're feeling a bit drained or a bit stressed out on this journey, because we've got the nine of swords, so this can be the sleepless nights and the worry and, you know, when we're missing our twin and we're thinking of them and connecting with them at night, remember the power of the love because this love will conquer all and you're coming out the other side right now of any fear. So I feel that your masculine has really been dealing with his own self. You know, he's been going through a dark night of the soul, especially perhaps since September time last year, coming to some real understanding of who he is and what he needs to change and what he needs to do to make this relationship with you real, you know, to make it a reality. So he's been facing the darker aspects, the shadow aspects of himself. And that's also been making him strong and powerful and ready for this next step and ready for mission. And I love that you've got this card because I'm feeling this is your power. You know, the white star is the promise of union, but also the promise of mission. And you guys have a mission together, you know, as light workers, as twin flames to help others to heal, to help yourselves to heal and to live your best life, but also to work on service and power. And that's what I'm feeling. So overcoming all these swords. And the swords are the emotions, the things we go through in our minds, the way we process our feelings and our fears around the past that can't be changed, childhood wounds, past lifetimes, things from the past, and the way we process our future and get ready for that future with power and grace. And that's what your masculine is showing you here, saying to you, I've been evolving and growing. And I feel that your masculine has done so much growing up spiritually since the last time you met or the last time you communicated or the last time you were in contact because he's showing that to you and he's preparing for his mission. And he's had to go through this darkness to find your light and to find the light within himself and from heaven. And the wheel of fortune is showing you that it's all falling into place. So in May, it's about this realisation that you do have a mission together and that union is possible for you and that things are falling into place and your dreams are coming true. I mean, this is beautiful. And, you know, since Easter energy, there's been all this rebirth coming in and this is going to be a month of dreams, communication, magic. So I definitely feel you're going to be connecting in dreams and your masculine will come to you in a dream through astral travel or dream walking and show you that this is real and if you're struggling to sleep it's because you're picking up on all of this change and all of these internal battles he's been going through to transform ready for your mission together and your dreams coming true and that's what I'm feeling 
And when you're meditating, connecting with source, feeling at peace, breathing, maybe watching a reading, you know this is true. You know things are aligning for you and you know that your journey is protected by angels and there's nothing to fear and that your journey is unfolding beautifully in this moment right now today. It's just there's things happening that need to be sorted out first. So the tower is the chaos. It's the upheaval. It's the change. We don't get change without some kind of growth because we get pushed forward. We release things and that takes us into an unknown energy, unknown territory, chaotic energy because we're stepping out of the comfort zone we've been stuck in. And we are powerful. And, you know, the thing I love about the tower card in this deck is even though that's a volcano and that shows that things are about to come to the surface, things are happening, eruption, passion, fire. I also see that red energy as a magician's cape, a lot like the cape that Doctor Strange wears, you know, in the Marvel series. And this is about taking control, magician energy, taking back power. So whatever towel moments come in, and the towel moments are, you know, the things we don't expect, the way the universe steps in with divine intervention and makes things happen, pushes us forward, makes us step out of our comfort zone, takes us into that unknown energy, but also gives us the power, the skills and the tools to feel at peace with any change. And the magician's cape is you knowing that you can handle it. Because whatever you're going through, it's going to not only make your dreams come true together, but it's also going to move you towards your mission together and your purpose and the reason you've come. So this is really about both of you in May taking control of your situation and seeing through illusion and connecting in dreams and through telepathy and your love power, that cosmic bond that's passionate and sexy and dynamic. And it's always there and it leads to peace. So I do feel there could be some chaos and upheaval this month to move things forward. So be flexible and adaptable. Be patient and calm. Be kind and loving and go with the flow because everything that's happening to you is happening for you. And that's being created by the universe to move things ahead, to get you both ready for your mission together, to work on your purpose and to find your way. Dreams are coming true, magic is happening, meditation, breath work, going in nature and connecting with your twin on the 5D are going to keep you strong. For some of you, you're definitely going to move into union or mission. But I feel for most of you, this is about learning lessons and moving forward to get you ready for what's to come. I hope this helps. Have a great month and I'll see you soon.